Hello and welcome to another one of my videos. Now today, as you can see, I'm in different surroundings. It's holiday time again and I've come away for a few days on my own. Unfortunately, my wife is still working, but I thought I'd take advantage. So here I am, away in the motorhome. And I thought while I'm here, I'll take a look at a breakfast. And this particular one is a Spanish breakfast menu too. So, let's get this on a table and see what this pack contains. So, as you can see, I now have this Spanish breakfast um, menu too. This particular one expired on the 5th of 2019, so it's a little bit out of date by about two months, but everything should still be okay. And as we know by now, there is a little green bag, not too strong, and I'll bring in another one of my little knives. Because I'm away on holiday, this is just a little folding camping utility knife that I have attached to my pack, um, but it's more than suitable for this job. And we'll just slit this open and see what this pack contains. So, inside the green packaging, there is the little cardboard box. So let's get this open and see what's actually inside. So straight off the top, we have a list of contents in Spanish, uh, English and French. And I think I'll put that to one side because it will help with my translations. Okay. So, what have we actually got in here? So I think straight off the top, we have a packet of sweet biscuits. You'll have to excuse the glare. There is a skylight directly above. So there's a packet of sweet biscuits. We have three packets of condensed milk. There is a tub of what I think is plum jam. I'm trying to hold that reflection away the best I can. There are Two fuel tablets. There is the box of matches, of book matches. There are two bags of instant coffee. I apologise for the glare. I know it's been very, very bad. I think that is a rehydration salts. There is some, I'm sure that is toothpaste. I think that is disinfectant hand wash, hand gel. There is a little bar of chocolate. Go sure and get it all in shot. I'm sure that is some gum. Try and get it away from the reflection for you. Some water sterilizing tabs. A very nice little folding toothbrush. Some tissue and of course the folding stove so that is the contents of this Spanish menu too so let's get these on a tray and see what they look and taste like so as you can see I now have this Spanish breakfast laid out on the tray and the first thing I'd like to do is take a quick look at this toothbrush. I don't intend to use it on camera, I'm going to keep it. I am currently away and this is perfect just for my sticking my backpack. So 
nice little simple toothbrush looks like you just turn it around push it into the handle and away you go what a nice touch obviously the uh, Spanish look after their teeth well so move that to one side save that for later and I think I'm going to start making up the drinks now these are a rehydration salts I've used them before this time the actual directions do tell you to pour them into your mouth and drink now I've had these before in both directions as in pouring it into the mouth which I found thoroughly unpleasant and mixing with water which is for me equally unpleasant but of the two I actually prefer it more mixed with water so I have a little bit of water here and I'm just going to pour them in hopefully they don't clump too much they're a very fine powder and I'm just going to try and stir those in now they don't want to mix let's use the crockery and cutlery I am in my camper van motorhome I only have the the facilities available to me so there we go so a quick taste of that strong taste of lemon um, it's a rehydration powder that's all I can say you know it's a rehydration powder I can't say it's pleasant to drink but you know it contains all those electrolytes which you need to replace on a daily basis so I would like to say I've had worse but I haven't so let's move on to the coffee so there was two coffee sachets I'm only using one in this instance um, a very fine ground coffee there and again I'm just going to top half a cup hot water and it comes with three packets of condensed milk I do like mine milky so and sweet this is just coffee I'll have a taste of the coffee first oh that's quite a bitter very bitter roast certainly something to lighten it so I'm going to try a little bit of this sweetened condensed milk that didn't quite go through the right area let's try again and I'm going to pour a little bit into my coffee now there's three packs of this so at the moment I should just only open one see how we go I just lightened it slightly let's give that a taste now that's much better in my opinion it needed lightening it needed sweetening it's a very bitter coffee mm. much better much much better so we'll have a look at these sweet biscuits nicely protected there nice pack of tostada biscuits I don't know if you can read that there I don't know if that's a brand in Spain it probably is it's probably a, a store brand but there's certainly a large pack of biscuits there we'll have a look at this chocolate One thing you do notice, very, very sugar laden breakfast. Um, it's not a lot more than just sugar, but a very nice looking bar of chocolate with a little sculptor, sculpture on there. And we have a plum jam. Nice looking.
looking plum jam there and finally we have a gum just get that gum nice large square briquette so not a lot really to be going on with so clearly we need to start with the biscuits we'll have a taste of those first mm. crispy crunchy sweet these are a dessert style biscuit as in they're not a cookie um, sorry they're not a, a cracker designed to go with cheese or anything they're the sort of thing that you want to dunk in your tea and your coffee mm. a sweet tasty plain biscuit very nice very nice quality I think you are supposed to eat them with an addition of some of the condensed milk there let's give that a try Mmm, very nice, very sweet, the condensed milk, there's a lot of sugar added, again it's a very sweetened condensed milk, I've made a bit of a mess opening this packet, it's not coming out very well, but it's a very nice sweetened condensed milk, goes very well with the biscuit, and I would certainly say these are a biscuit or a cookie, not a cracker by any means mm. a taste of the plum jam again nicely set nicely thickened nice thick preserve there mm. again very sweet very tasty great with the biscuits We can taste of the coffee. Oh, my opinion, vastly improved with that sweetened condensed milk added. And finally, let's have a bite of this chocolate. It's almost a shame to bite into that to ruin that nice little image there, but. So milk chocolate of the cheaper variety but it's still perfectly edible it's the sort of thing that here in the UK we get um, cheap Christmas decorations that we hang on the Christmas tree made out of chocolate and it's that sort of chocolate everyone in the UK would know what I mean now so it's not a high quality chocolate but it's decent it's decent enough and it's a milk chocolate not high cocoa content but Chocolate is chocolate, still very enjoyable. So, very simplistic breakfast. Quick recap the coffee, very bitter, very dark on its own. The addition of the sweetened condensed milk made all the difference. The electrolyte powders are just that. The electrolyte powders, your choice whether you pop them straight into your mouth or in a glass. I've tried both, personally I prefer them with a little bit of water and drink it this way, others would disagree, but it is a hydration salts rather than a cooling drink. Chocolate, cheap style, milk chocolate, the sort of thing we find in cheap um, Christmas decorations and things like that here in the UK, but still, it's a, it's a, it's a chocolate bar. The biscuits, tostada very nice very sweet certainly a cookie and a biscuit um, would go great dipped in your tea goes well with the jam and the sweetened condensed milk it's certainly a sweet biscuit not a cracker but very very nice and very good quality the jam the same good quality nice and thick uh, this one's a plum jam but it's very very nice very tasty and the sweetened condensed milk is just that. It's very sweet and it's very condensed, but again, a very nice 
um, addition to this breakfast. And it's just the bre um, one last thing to try. Just try this gum. Mm. Nice sized brick, briquette. Decent mint flavour, mint quality. Crispy shell, not too coarse, not too hard. So, overall, a very decent breakfast, very sweet. It's not very good for a diabetic, but a very sweet, enjoyable, light breakfast. So, I'm going to leave it there. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification button for future videos coming very soon. So, thank you. And goodbye.